What is going on guys? Kevin over at Legros coming back to you with another video today. This one is four pounds of figs. I paid $680 if you can believe that for this one. A lot of it was a mystery. So this is going to be a mystery haul for us today. I don't know what's in here. You don't know what's in here, but it was a lot of figs and I saw some stuff on the top that seemed like it could be okay. So we're going to go ahead and dive in and hope that it is okay. Uh, this is not an individual box for some reason in here, uh, or bag, I should say, for some reason, but I'm not sure what that is there for. So let's go ahead and go through that first, uh, and then we'll dump some st stuff out. Probably going to be a couple of videos on this as well, because uh, just a lot of figs to go through for one person. Stores at ubit.com slash where you can find all of these things. All the links in the description for our whatnot store and all of the other fun things that you can go to. Uh, this looks like somebody knew what the things were almost. <laughs> this could be all the good figs. Uh, but yeah, go and check us out on whatnot. $10 for free for you. $10 for me as well, if you use that link below. Uh, and uh, we're having some fun over there. Let's go ahead and get started. This one is the Overlord. Not a bad fig right off the bat. We do have a $20 Overlord right there. Uh, Woody, not bad at all either. Another Ting right here. We have Doc Ock with the clenched mouth. These guys were selling for upwards of $100 when Spider-Man came out. They have come down to earth here a little bit uh, since then, but that's okay. Uh, we do have um, Jack. That's still a good fig anyways, I should say. We have Frodo from the Shelob set, I believe, with the scared face and the ring. The Precious right there. Not a bad figure right there to go along with Sam Wise and his little light as well. So both of those figs were in there for sure. I did see some Lord of the Rings, which is another reason why I snapped this one up. Bilbo, not much value there, but we do have Feely here, which is a great one, and Beetlejuice. Yeah, it looks like they knew what kind of figs were going to be valuable. Uh, we have Toriel. That's not a bad one either. I don't think it's quite Ting worthy, but it is pretty good. A Goblin. I don't think that those are... Uh, from Gringotts anyways. I don't think those are super good. Little mini snake. We got Gollum times two. One's got the precious falling into the uh, lava right here. We have Luna Lovegood with the lion outfit, I believe is what that one is. That'd be my guess anyways. I think so, right? I don't know. We got a minion missing his hair, I think. And his eyes are... Is I supposed to be like that? Oh, yeah, they're, never mind. They're just eyelids. Okay. <laughs> Missing his hair, I believe, though. Space Batman, that's a pretty decent one. Kind of mid-value. Iron Man, we know just what to do with him. And boom, 2006 Joker right there. No magnet, not a magnet. Fantastic ting right there. About 40 bucks is what that one's worth. Don't know what that shield is. Comment below if you guys know what that shield is. Not sure. Uh, we have Centurion Batman, I believe is what his name is. He's got this gigantic sword. I'm guessing that's the one he comes with. That's a fantastic figure right there, too. I think that's a Dimensions figure, if I'm not, if I'm not, uh, not wrong. Uh, we do have Hot Dog Guy. That's a highly requested fig from our Whatnot streams. Uh, E.T., that one will do well as well. That one, I think, is a kind of a mid-value. We have Beetlejuice's uh, little, little uh, Dimensions plate there, too, which is kind of cool. Uh, what else do we have? Some Ninjago, little Alien, Captain America. We got Buzz. Of course, we got to have Spider-Man all bent up. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> terrible. Just terrible. Uh, and then we have Gandalf and a Batman helmet. All right. I'm just going to go ahead and grab some of these things and pour them on out. I don't know what we're grabbing, but we're grabbing some just to grab out of the box and put on the table. And then we'll see what's what after a little bit. I see a lot of like motorcycles and things like that. That's kind of a bummer because those things are heavy. Uh, they do take up take up some of the weight. They take up some of the weight. There are some poly bags in here as well, which I'm guessing are probably like advent calendars uh, or something to that effect. That looks like a good start. That looks like a good start. Let's go ahead and go grab all these bags here real quick. We'll sell these ones pretty quickly, hopefully on whatnot as well. Uh, these are all Harry Potter. Looks like probably advent calendar Harry Potter figs. Nothing much there. Those are weird leg Weird, like, no legs, just dresses figures, I'm guessing. They're going for dresses. Uh, some pieces. Obviously don't need pieces. Motorcycle. This horse is actually pretty cool. I haven't seen the gold one. That actually could be valuable. Some of the friends' horses are actually pretty good. I'm going to put that one in the research pile as well, because that one might actually be pretty decent. The Raptors and Dilophosaurus. Unfortunately, this one is not very worth very much. The Raptors tend to be worth about 20 bucks a piece, so that one's not bad. We'll put that one up there, though. That one is super creepy. Not sure what to do with that, but uh, we'll put it over here. <laughs> <laughs> we'll put it over here for now. Real or fake? Sometimes they're so good, I just can't tell. I just can't tell sometimes. Not sure what that fig was. Just the uh, the flat beige. We got Voldemort in the house. We got Ron Weasley. Uh, here is the start of Fairy Batman. Not quite complete, though. Uh, Space Police CMF, I believe, is what that comes from. 
We do have Nightwing slash Arctic Batman, and one of the newer black horses with the movable legs, and the Lord of the Rings ones, the brown with the movable legs. Uh, we have Magneto. That's kind of mid-value there as well. Not bad, not bad. Ooh, I think that is the King, which have been going up in value like crazy since that castle got released. I'm pretty sure that's Dareth, if I'm not mistaken. I'm going to put that down here as well. Actually, put it in research uh, for right now, because I'm not 100% sure. Comment below if that's Dareth. <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, free hairs. Yes, I love free hair. That's my favorite thing. I love free hair. Absolutely love it. Uh, <laughs> uh, not much there. Just a mismatch. Knight's Kingdom. Not bad. Not bad. Don't think that... Is that the... It's a castaway guy? I've never seen that fig before. Huh. It's kind of cool. Put it in the series fig. Uh, nothing there. We got a Skulkin. Friends fig. That one is, I believe, a Lone Ranger fig. Not 100% sure, uh, but I think that's what it is. That's supposed to be Ursula's hair, right? A lot of mismatch we have to fix. That's most of my job is fixing mismatch. Another mini snake. We got Tonto and Pow. That one's pretty good. He's got his little sticker there. I'll put a helmet on him, and he's actually a pretty good fig. Not super value, but he's pretty good. There's a knight. We got Batgirl from Friends. More Friends. More Friends. Construction guy. Where's all the figs that we need? <laughs> Maybe they're at the bottom. I don't know. Hopefully. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. Little mini... Don't know what that one is supposed to be. Anna? Maybe? I think this is Doctor Who. Not 100% sure the value on that guy. We'll put him down there kind of in the middle as well. Uh, old school space. That's always fun to get. Nothing there. I'm guessing that's probably, yep, no idea. No idea what that one is. Uh, nothing there. That one I haven't seen before either. What the heck? What are all these things? That one might have been fake. I don't know. <laughs> uh, Blackbeard's beard. That one's pretty cool. Put that one down here. Uh, Newt Gunray. Oh, there's a ting right there for you. Killer Croc, fantastic condition. 35 bucks for that guy right there. We're back in the game. Uh, that's a fake, nothing there. Don't know what that one's supposed to be either. These are usually the little book figures uh, that come with the little friends books, like princess books and stuff like that. Uh, we do have, I believe, Luke. One of the newer versions of Luke, kind of. Slightly newer, anyway. Uh, and Aquaman, to round it up. Everything else is just a city fig and a Batman. Uh, we do have another Dimensions fig. What is this? Doctor Who? That looks weird enough to be a Doctor Who fig. Comment below if I'm wrong. <laughs> I very well could be. Not bad, not bad. Not it's uh we're just we just went through about a pound and uh hopefully it all ends up like that. I don't know if they separated out the valuable figs or maybe the ones that they displayed on the picture or something to that effect. Hopefully we have more to come. Uh we're gonna go through more of course in the next video, so stay tuned for that. Hit that subscribe button if you're not already. Smash like. I love you, and I'll catch you on the next one.